Hey guys, just want to uh, quickly go over with you the process, the procedure that we have in place for doing the at-home meat delivery that I've been doing. Um, what's going to happen is about a half hour, uh, 20 minutes before I arrive at the customer's house, I'm going to text them and I'm going to explain that I'm on my way, however long it'll take to get there. Uh, please stay inside, go by a window, go by a door, but do not come outside, leave a physical barrier and um, watch for me delivering the food. When I pull up, I will text them again and say, okay, I'm here now. Like I said, please stay inside. And then I will exit the truck wearing a uh, respirator. All right, a, uh, this is actually an N100 respirator, which is better than the N95 that we all hear about. I will put on, I will slather up in some hand sanitizer and then I will put on some latex gloves and then I'll go through the coolers and put together the order. I'll bring it up to the front of the house, drop it off on the porch, and then I will walk away. Uh, when I get back to my truck, I will take off the gloves, put them into the garbage bag, and then I will reapply copious amounts of sanitizer back into my truck. And then that's the, uh, and that's the point where the customer can come outside and get their package. This way there's, I'm, I'm clean. I'm, I'm sanitizing my hands. Uh, I'm not exposing anyone to the virus and nobody is exposing it to me. And this is uh, what's going to happen for every stop. So for every stop, it will be fresh new gloves put on and taken off and thrown into the garbage. So nothing is going from stop to stop.